Hi friends, here we have one of the motor which is three phase induction motor, squirrel cage induction motor. We are going to rewind this motor. We have rewinded this motor and uh, now we are going to connect interconnections for the coils we are going to make and also for the leads as these leads are coming off of the motor outside and we are supplying power to. Uh, this is delta motor, delta connected motor and uh, one and a half kilowatt motor and it's uh, rpm this is four pole so on 50 hertz frequency its rpm is four fourteen hundred one thousand four hundred rpm uh, now we are going to connect these coils some people they are making winding of aluminium wire so aluminium wire is not perfect for the winding so must you have to must use copper winding because copper is good for winding and the interconnections they are also connected very perfect uh, hey, here we can use this uh, flux for the uh, connections i mean to say for the soldering flux is better because if you have flux these connections this uh, soldering will be perfect if uh, we do it dry so it will not be perfect so here we are using flux for this purpose this is normal soldering procedure if you watch my other videos you also experience this thing that i'm using flux in most of the time for the soldering uh, so this motor has 12 coils in and uh, each phase has four coils interconnected and they are interconnected in, in some specific order. I will show in some other video because this motor had been completed in some other video. I will make a perfect motor in front of you, a complete motor. So then you will understand how these interconnections are made. Uh, this is our complete knowledge. I mean to say this is a science or art you can say, uh, which is experienced base. Uh, you should have to have good experience in and then you will be able to do. Uh, so this motor was we created and hopefully it will run it will run like a horse in industry These are the running horses in industry these in squirrel cage induction motors They are everywhere. I mean to say in our plant. Maybe they will be some something 900 or 800 motors we have uh, So these motors are this is in workshop normal practice. Uh, so people uh, hopefully you learned something from this video if you learned something from this video give a big thumbs up subscribe on my channel press and bell icon so we'll get notifications thank you for watching